Hey guys, Ryzen here, back with an episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. So in the last episode, we did the classified information quest in the health center. And now, we'll be finding all of the Kimono Girls. So I found one of the Kimono Girls in Route 7. So in the previous episode, and now, the next Kimono Girl is said to be somewhere in GDC. Found in the lobby of Judicial Police Department. Okay. Judicial Police Department. Let's let's check that out. Not sure. Let's say Judicial Police Department. Where is the department? This one? Um, hello? Doing, uh, do you need to talk to the, talk with this officer? I'm sorry, but that will have to wait. Some thief stole my precious Pokemon while I was honoring food for us. Yes, about that. What did the thief look like? Not sure, they seem like any other kid. Do you know what direction they ran off in? Looked like he was running towards Grand Room Station. They could honestly be anywhere at this point. Well, the Garen City Tram is out of service. While well, we conduct our investigations with the broken track. So, that could mean they're still in the city or route 9. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but could you go look for this person? Can't afford to stay in the city for much longer. I have a festival to prepare for. Okay. So I guess we need to go to route 9. Okay, let's see. The thief can be found on the beach in route 9. Okay. Let's go there. I'll see you guys on route 9, alright? Okay, remember where to Look, what? You're looking for someone who stole some Kimono Girls Pokemon? I don't know what you're talking about, Weirdo. Fine. Uh, no. Fine, if that's what you want, put him up. Here we go. Explode, huh? Multi attack. Ah, that is a lot of damage. Next up is Bear. Okay. I would like to use Stalin Flame here. You, I used the wrong move. My bad. Okay, okay. Still Valley, use multi attack. That kind of sucks. Heracross, use air release. Moxie, Snorlax, use Brick Break. Okay, ah oh, man, alright, I'll go back and give that Pokemon back to the Kimono Girl. Where is she now? She's at the police station in the judicial district? I'll make my way there then. Alright, good. Okay, I think I'll see you guys back in the judicial police station. Alright, I'm here. Oh, you came back at last. The young man who stole my Pokemon returned. He said that the trainer bested him in battle and forced him, forced him to return what he stole. I assume that was you, no? Well, even if that wasn't the case, I'm happy. I suppose I'll head back home now. Goodbye. Okay, that's one police... Uh, one of them. Then the next one is in the District of Hope. Alright. Let's go there. In the district of hope. Here you are. Please, go away. You're frightening me. It looks like she's having a nightmare. Wait, what? What is going on? I don't know what's going on. Anyways, 
Oblitus. Next is Oblitus Town before Kelvin's home. Oblitus Town. Okay. And Honex Prime as well. Oh man, this is so confusing. Oh, wait a minute. I need to return to Rodia's apartment and have a nightmare. Okay. Let's go and have a nightmare in Rodia's apartment, I guess. Where was Rodia's apartment again? And I keep forgetting stuff. Here it is. Let's go have a nightmare. Alright, now. Let's see. I had a nightmare and now what? Once inside, head to the slot machine and find a sable eye watching her. Oh, found her. Okay. We we can actually catch this one. It can even mega evolve, so I would like to catch it. So yeah, let's give it a shot. Here we go. Use glare. Poison tail. That didn't do much. Alright, good. Now. Go premier ball. Now that kind of sucks. I want to catch it with a premier ball. Because we haven't used premier ball for a while. Come on. All right, nice. Oh my, oh my. Here, I have such a scary, such a scary, and I have such a scary, what? I'm glad I was able to see you right back. See you. Glad to be right back to be able to go home and sleep. Wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay, I guess she's gone. Does that mean she has returned? And then get back to the district of hope. Okay, I guess we need to go back again. Back. Oh, wait. Wake up. Sable Eye, one of the Pokemon that I can train. It has Prankster ability as well when it never evolves, so... I mean, it normally has Prankster ability, even without Mega Evolution, but it's pretty useful, you know. I really haven't been training new Pokemon, have I? Hey! Ah! You look familiar to me, have we met before? Ah, in your dreams? Ah, I remember you clearly. You saved me from that the starly table eye. I must thank you for doing so. Okay. What's that? I, I say that we have to get back so we can practice. I suppose she's right. The festival is only a few days away. Is it not? Well, I guess I'll be back. Okay. Now the next one. Is in the Grand Bridge to the right. I've already done that. Then Oblitus Town. Let's go to Oblitus Town, I guess. Let's quickly heal up though.
Yeah, I bet the side quest is taking too long, isn't it? Yeah, Oblivious Town is over here. There should be one of the kimono girls somewhere here. Let's see. In Oblivious Town. But where? Oh, I think I already done that. Right below Kelvin's home. Yeah, that one I already did it. Then Grand Bridge to the right. The Grand Bridge. Wasn't this the Grand Bridge? Yeah, this is the Grand Bridge. Ah, found you. Oh, you found Moy in a very interesting place now. I just wanted to experience a little time alone while listening to the waves. I read a book once you have learned to how to dance by looking at the wave move. They swing back and forth like metronome. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to tell you that forgot that you are here. Please take this as an apology. Ah, I think I've learned enough from the waves today. I'll head back home now. You should visit us on Route 9 whenever you get a chance. All right. The next one is in Darkside Manor. And another one in Honic Shrine. Let's go there. I guess Honic Shrine is very close, so let's go there. This is Honic World. I don't know where Honic Shrine is though. Well, we'll find out. On it trying, huh? Wait, there is a place over there. Have I been there? Ah, found it. There you are. Oh, did you know the legend surrounding these stone statues? Apparently, the beings expected here were real at one point. Humanity sought them out vigorously so that they could further their ideals to create the red chain. Oh. To prevent the red chain from being created, they turned themselves into stone. Many people mourned their passing, so they were constructed into statues. Oh, but thank you for listening to me and ramble on some old fairy tales. I think it's I'm going to return to the place where I belong. May we meet again. Alright. Wait a minute, there's a something down here. Ah, so this is how they are connected. Makes sense. Okay then. I don't think there's anything here. So we should be heading to Starside Manor now. That should be the last place we need to go. Or maybe the second last place. We also have to go to the beach, I guess. I think I'll see you guys in Darkside Manor. See you guys there. Okay, I'm in dark side, dark side setting. Here it is. I remember seeing the kimono girl over here. Oh, hello. What's the trainer doing all the way out here? Um, no. Oh, well, at least you're honest with me. Maybe one day you'll appreciate things a little more. I want me to head back to the theater. I suppose the festival is around the corner. Practice makes perfect. All right, I'll be on my way then. All right. So let's see here. I've done the judicial one. That's one done. Then district of hope done. Grand bridge to the right done. Oblitus town done. Darkside manor honic shrine done. Route nine in the same place as TM flame tour. That's where we need to go. Yeah, that's the last one actually. All right, I'll see you guys in route nine then. Okay, I'm in route 9 and I'll see you guys on the top where I found There she is. I'll see you guys there. I remember you showing you guys that I went up there to get flamethrower TM. So yeah, I'll see you guys up on top. Okay, here I am. I love the autumn. Such a nice and pleasant breeze. 
It reminds me of times when I used to live in a cruise city with my mother. Oh, have you been standing there all this time? Just, that's slightly creepy, but I suppose you were just gazing the nature of beauty too, no? That's good. Nature should be admired by both people and Pokemon. After all, that's th this planet's gift to us, beings who resides on it. We shouldn't tarnish gifts that has been passed down to us. What's that? Ion wants me to return so that we can perform once again? Ah, I see. I suppose that's something I can do. Thank you for passing on the message to me. What's your name? Ah, Ryzen is good. I really appreciate it, Ryzen. Alright, I'll see you guys back in the manor or the place where, you know, we took on the quest. Okay, here I am. I'm gonna quickly save the game though. I can't do it anymore. I heard the Kumino Gearworks are back, so I took their challenge. I was completely destroyed. I couldn't defeat them all. I was going to leave the place. I can't even show my face to anyone in around here. Wow. Wait, what? We have to battle the Kimono Girls now? That's pretty... That's pretty crazy. Let's see. Do we have to fight them? Once you have defeated all eight. All eight. Okay. I guess we do have to defeat them, huh? Alright. Let's see what they got. And now that we are all here, would you like to accept our challenge? You must defeat all of us in succession without losing one. Of course, if you're successful, then you will see where you are. What do you say? Excellent. Do you believe that there is darkness present in everyone's heart? Do you believe that humanity is an inherently evil? Perhaps I will be able to change your mind about that. <laughs> Is it gonna be Umbreon? Yeah. X is over. Wow, level 80. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, okay, level 80. I wasn't expecting that at all. Okay, I think I will take up this challenge once I have got myself next gym badge. For now, I'm just gonna continue on with the story, alright? Because I really don't appreciate doing very high level quests in the right now way. Anyways, let's see. I need to go to the Rose Theater. Okay. Upstairs, right? Is it this one? Aaron, please listen to me. I have no nothing to say to you right now, Alita. I know I tricked you, but it was something I had to do. Perhaps that was the case. I'm very annoyed by the fact that you refused to let me help you. Instead, you chose to throw me under the bus. That was always the plan, right? I don't think... I don't know what else to say. You know, people used to usually say I'm sorry to people they have wronged. Has the phrase ever left your vocabulary? Fine, be that way, stay bitter. I've had enough of all of you anyway. I don't know who you were before all this, but all you do is think about yourself now. You all keep saying th the same boring phrase to me over and over. It's all about the incident and the person I was before. Have I really changed that much? You really don't remember what happened to you, do you? Fine, let me bring some light into your little situation. When I found you, you were completely untouched, but the woman was badly injured. We tended to her first and then subject, uh, subject quickly switched to you. Apparently, you have been inflicted with some ancient Gorosan curse. And since Soda is a spiritual healer, we brought you to the main hall for healing. 
Is she going gonna be okay? She seems so lifeless already. Hmm, it's possible, but it will be very difficult. There are many locks around her heart and soul. Much more inflicts this girl than a singular groove and purse. Oh, Vivian. Removing the chains around her soul and heart, I don't know what this will lead to. It is best that if we prepare, if we are prepared for a darker situation. A dark situation? Could you be a little less vague? Hmm, Erin, please gather the prayer slips and get ready. Got it. The kimono girls are in place. They shall begin their prayers. We shall begin the ceremony immediately. Hmm, I see you there with your cane held eye. Think you could swing that stick just like in the old days? You know I still got it. I'm going to stab my ears and then my eyes. Please just continue the ceremony. Oh, annoying the youth is my favorite pastime. Anywho, let us begin. Erin, are those slips done? I need a few more minutes. There's still a couple of left to go. Please hurry, we don't have all night. These chains around Elita's soul, will unlocking them harm her? No, but I have no idea what kind of effect it will have on other sites. Her mental state may be different from what you, you're, you're used to. I see. I'm going to proceed with unlocking this change. Great. Sora, what is this? What's going on? I don't know. Erin, the prayer slips, please. Erin, the prayer slips. I'm almost done with them, you old man. They're, these must be perfect. If even a single one is off, these won't do a thing. And all of these will be in for naught. Alita, she's awake. No, that's not Alita, that's... <laughs> so, don't take your eyes off her, I'm just fine. You can't complete the ritual. My god, what happened to this girl? Could this course be this powerful? What's happening in here? Is there a situation? Yes, by staying back. Erin, please! Don't nag me, I'm on it. Go to Ah. After everything settled down, you woke up, but something was different. You were far more aggressive, you broke things, damaged the place, you even heard one of the kimono girls, Beatrice. Things got real rough that Sora considered banishing you both from the theater, but ultimately he decided that it would be far too dangerous for the eldest to handle. Sora tried one last thing, reattached the chains that he removed on your soul. With the help of the kimono girls, the sealed kimono was created. It's the one you're wearing right now. Oh. With it and a few prayers, you can revert back to the old Elita. For now at least. We, are, we weren't watching you just to make sure you're okay. We we're watching to make sure, watching you to make sure you couldn't, wouldn't harm anyone. We we're looking out for the people who live in these parts. So now just imagine what would happen if suddenly one of the prayers wasn't enough. What if you lost sight of who you were again? What would happen? You would go off toward people other orders because you couldn't control yourself. I would have been responsible for each and every person you touch. That's why I'm upset with you. That's why we cannot let you out of your sight anymore. Do you understand now, Aunt Elita? Erin, I'm so sorry for everything. Sai, I'm choosing to give you the benefit of doubt. You didn't know any of this. We didn't want to risk causing a flare-up we can't control. That's what we fear most. I understand. Everyone. Elders, I have to apologize. That can wait. We, you all need to turn on the TV on. TV now. What? Let's do what she said. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Garen News Special. I'm here to announce the participants of the festival tournament coming up. 
we have already gone through the bracket A to D and fourth bit of the bracket E. And so now we are going through the final list. A few participants in bracket E are Jean, Marianne, Leo, Lucian, Aaron, Aaron, Alita, Venom, Melia, Canon, Ryzen, and the beautiful and talented Risa Ryder. Thank you all for watching. Do tune in next time. Wait, what? Why are we in the tournament? That reporter said all of our names. What is this? I didn't sign up for any tournament. Considering our actions, I don't think any of us has. We surely don't have to take part in it. I don't remember the TOS for signing up for the tournament, but I remember there being this huge thing over people not showing up for the tournament after they signed up. A lot of money was wasted for spots that weren't filled in the end. Cassandra was livid. Livid. If we wanted to get out of this, we we are probably going to have to pay a huge fee. I think we could possibly risk this deal time. I don't know about you guys, but I'm not gonna swing. Uh, I'm not exactly swimming in gas. Uh, this is all just so awful. What can we do about this? I need to make a phone call. It will be quick. For now, just wait for the others to get here. Got it. Ryzen, we can chill a bit at the restaurant downstairs. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, that's just a window. It's too bad I'm not strong enough. Let's save the game. Over here, Ryzen. Can't believe I was the kind of person Aaron described. I heard I would never do such a thing. I mean, with I mean it with all my heart. You believe me, right, Ryzen? Um, I guess I do. I can't tell if you're being genuine with me, but I don't think this is your fault. It's mine. Hey guys, elite. Whoa. Okay. Wait, that ribbon. Hmm. Apparently, the police found it in Venom's possession. It was my birthday gift for me, from both of you. I decided to open it a little earlier than I intended, but thank you so much, Ryzen. Sada said his healing may not be enough. As long as there is an attempt, I'll be satisfied. You kids are wasting your energy on hope that doesn't exist. Excuse me, excuse you. Once someone is turned into stone like that, it's impossible to return impossible to return them care to know care to share how you know that wait a minute you are the guy who zoomed right past us in the marine cube and you are the lot that fought team zen on terra zuma i didn't know at that time but you're all connected to something i'm trying to find confirm this for me the thing that died on valor mountain what was its name Wait, what? That thing that died in Valor Mountain? Okay, the thing that died in Valor Mountain is definitely Nim. Nim. Now it all makes sense. I. It would take her name. That's all I need to hear. But, just a word of advice for you all. That thing isn't dead. It can't die so easily like that. Stop calling, calling her an it. Her name was Nim. And she's our friend. You sound like her, my sister, Alexandra. Going on about this nonsense, about it being a good person and all, that thing is no person at all. Nim's body may have been destroyed, but it's likely reformed elsewhere, just like it did before. 
You're saying that Nim is alive? How is that possible? You need to know what you think it is. And that you should watch your back. It may come for you all next. But that's enough of that. I'm going to enjoy my food and head back home. I have a sneaky suspicion my sister is on her way home after hearing such devastating news. Sir, what is your name? How impolite of me. I'm Damien. I'm the 18th Dragon type gym leader. Please me make your acquaintance. Wait a minute, is he the gym leader from Oblitus Town? Oh wow. A gym leader. Now, if you'd excuse me, I've heard enough of this jerk. Your presence was mutually appreciated. You're an asshole. I don't care. Now that everyone's here, we can probably go see what Sora's up to, Ryzen. Let's leave this guy to rot. Alright. Go away, right. Anyway, I feel like I'm gonna end this episode off right here, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Until then, bye bye.